the abuse is too much. This is seen almost on a daily basis by the trucks that move our animals to the slaughter places in very unrecommended ways. The parking is too much. We have minimum space requirements per vehicle. But you really see the vehicles overpacked, the animals over restrained. You look at one and you see the tail almost peeling off. This is very bad because it gives a lot of cruelty to the animals and does not stop there. Even the quality of meat of such an animal becomes affected. There, is also, there are also practices of mixing. For example, they mix uh, cattle with, uh, with the goats, with these small ruminants. So as you transport them, they tend to trample on each other and they, they sustain injuries which and, uh, affect their welfare. At the same time, these very long distances that we transport animals also affect their welfare. They lead to the animals accumulate a lot of stress. Our recommendation to government on that issue, especially of uh, movement of animals, the way we transport animals, is to come out much more strict on it. Because, of course, we have the regulations, the, the, the laws are there. The, we have the Prevention of Cruelty Act. We have uh, some other guidelines on the way animals have to be transported. So. I think uh, the, the, the biggest gap that we are having is with implementation. And the, here we are calling upon government to, to, to enhance their implementation plans, to, to bring uh, other stakeholders on board, to work together, to make sure that these beautiful laws that we have are well implemented and animals are transported in the appropriate manner.